you say um look at aids so you think right if we go just one generation back mm. from aids we go for nixon nixon's biggest enemies were hippies and black people what, what is hippies hippies were like flower children flower people, children people who were against conformity we're talking about like a young bob dylan is around like your grandmother's baggage you know. <laughs> That's a whole generation. Yeah. <laughs> did you know about that? Yes, of course. You did. I know about that. So, his biggest political enemies. So, he basically made it so that if you smoked some marijuana yeah. or had some recreational amount of caffeine, you could go to prison for life. Just for that. For, for a pretty minor thing. You know, and that and that also translates to abortion rights and free speech and so on and so forth. Um, if we get on to AIDS, okay, AIDS was the next thing. AIDS. So anyway, when I was in high school, AIDS became a thing. And AIDS, uh, what we thought was that is a gay men's disease. But in Africa, even today, it is a horrible, horrible, horrible pandemic of Africa. You know, maybe just Africa. I don't know. I think we manage it pretty well in the rest of the world. But Africa is still suffering from AIDS. George Bush Jr. certainly cared about Africa and AIDS. Um, you know, but was it... What you were saying was, was it on purpose? You know, was it like an attack on poor people? Was it an attack on so anyway liberals? Or okay. Whatever? So like, uh, well, like I'm saying about uh, these uh, the pandemic now, maybe it's man-made or you know planted. But when you say, it, oh, look at AIDS. So, uh, for people to think uh, about this pandemic, corona pandemic, like is a man made, it's a bullshit, right? I think it would be a mistake to say that it was bullshit. I think it would be a mistake to say that uh, someone's conspiracy theory about a disease which majority targets. Asians, uh, Asians in China, or uh, black people, or gay people, or whatever. Mm. Uh, you know, something that is so like specific mm. to lifestyle, and you know, we can't say that gay is being gay is a lifestyle choice. It isn't. You know, like, people are just born gay, whatever. Um, but but do you know that you know when true this... or not, we have to respect that. I, because yeah, that's what they think. Exactly. Yeah. So why, I mean, some people think like this uh, pandemic is just made for big countries like China or America to profit, I mean, to get money. What do you think about that? Um, wow, that's difficult. In this thing, I have my own opinion. Yeah. You know, there are some evidence that uh, this virus was made by man in those basements, those bio basements about in Europe, in America, and uh, it was targeted on China, but uh, after that, it lost control. So, you know, those science, science, scientists and uh, those researchers has, have already found some evidences about uh, this is an artifact virus. All right. What I love okay. about so, this guy okay. is, Just a he is very mainline Chinese thinking. Yeah, you know. but listen, uh, for example... I'm not saying right or wrong. In, in Wuhan... I, I can call bullshit whatever, but he is very mainline Chinese thinking. 
mm. about about this. Like we're talking about a person from within China who thinks what most Chinese people think. Yes. Yeah. Mm. You know, but but um, I can't say that he's wrong. This pandemic brought, you know, different thinking from, you know, people from different countries. For instance, in, from my country, the former president who is dead, you know, he, I mean, took to lab laboratory like papayas and everything and found that they would tell there's corona. It, it was a controversial thing. Thing, this for people to benefit, or oh, is it a true disease? Power, superpower, who, what? <laughs> Wait, is there any superpower in Africa? No, no, there isn't. South Africa, maybe. No. Africa, you know. Yeah, he just said. Yeah. I can't. All right. Can. How can you compare AIDS and uh, Corona? You, you look young anyway. You're so young. I don't know if you know about AIDS, but how I can know. you compare AIDS and Corona? I don't think AIDS are AIDS. I mean, this virus is dangerous or uh, it can be controlled. And uh, I mean, and it killed a lot of people. But after all, we can control it by some some ways. Like, uh, like hospitals, what? like mm -hmm. hospital, yeah, but, what? But rich countries like China and the United States mm. can control it. France, England, Germany, Switzerland. We population. Anyway, guys, we will be back in a minute. Masunga <laughs> John. Sorry, it's DJ. Hey.